Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Some double-A baseball coming at you. It's the Binghamton Rumble Ponies and the Portland Sea Dogs. And now, please welcome... Your First pitch coming your Portland way next. Sea Dogs. So up next, Jay Mack. You know, when you look around the game and think about the best power hitters in the sport, this guy is one of the first names you got to come up with. Hey, you can do it. No one bet. Let's go. Swing and a deep drive. This one's got a chance. Way back there, and boom goes the dynamite. He powers one out to right field, and they throw a pair on the board. It's 2-0. was a hanger and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that and right there he made him pay base is empty yeah, one man. away Jay Mack will hit next Yay. he's already homered Mack. here in this one Mack only 18 years old and he's driven in double digit runs over his last 10 games and first offering is fouled off. Hey, here we go, kid. One down, base is empty. Swings here and blasts one left field. And it's caught just in front of the wall. And welcome back. All right, we go to the top half of inning number six. And now it's going to be Jay Mack. On the mound, he had a little trouble back in the first, but it's been a different story the rest of the way. Really settled into this outing nicely. Swing and a deep drive. This one's got a chance. Way back there, and boom goes the dynamite. His second home run of the game, and they close the gap. It's 6-3. Now he's just showing off out there, and who can blame him with a swing like that? Give that man a bat, watch it go a long way. That one got in the jet stream on a line drive. We saw the numbers on the backs of the jerseys of the outfielders, which is usually bad news. And all of a sudden, they're back in this ball game. Man at first, now and now the DH, Jay Mack. Yay. Hit an absolute yeah. tape measure shot last time up. And nice and patient. Get your pitch. Shoots a line drive single into right center. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. Love how he let that ball travel. Trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. So here's the cleanup hitter, number two, one for three. Hey, get a good one up there, huh? Right hander kicks deals, and it's filled up. Careful. Find some green, baby. Find some green. And the righty deals. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. And here's the first baseman, JT Schwartz. JT Schwartz. Runners at first and second with one gone. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. Tough spot right here, a couple runners on. Two ball count. You can't nibble, but you have to execute and finish your pitch. If you leave something out over the plate, it's going to bring in some runs. Swings and misses. 
Two balls, two strikes. They can live up in the zone all game if guys will chase it. That's just too much velocity. Hitters got to look down in the zone. Riding to the plate. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Now, this pitching staff has been merciless against him in this one. I mean, he struck out six times in this series, and we've seen no adjustment out of him so far. And here is Luke Ritter. Next offering is in for a strike. Got it by him for the K. Two left on. Home half of inning number eight straight ahead. The Sea Dogs lead it eight to three. Whether you're a season ticket holder or you just come to a couple of games a year, to see your team win at home, there's just something special about that. Good job by these guys to get it done for the hometown fans. 8-3 the final in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long.